Hi everybody, this is part two. This is a haul from um, um, Hope Chest. Um, I went to go meet up with my daughter, and that was early, so I just went in and picked up a few things. And this is what I picked up. Um, sorry for the rattling of the, of the paper. Um, I have this, it's like for cheese, but I have a customer that likes this kind of stuff. And there's this, this other one. In this place, they left the, the prices on there. And then I have, I found two of these. There's a little um, these are two little Avon bottles. And I collect these, so I'm gonna keep one and sell one. And here um, I remember the receipt was I, I spent six dollars and fifty one cents. Nope, I took it back. Because I had a little bit of a discount, so five dollars and twenty-one cents. And then I got this cobalt blue vase. Because a while back I sold my other one. This was too big. This one is small, and I think I might keep this. So we'll see. And like I said before, all this is going to just be incorporating some of my live sales and then I got this now there's a label on the bottom but it's wishy washed but it's very cute this decanter oh, how pretty that is very adorable I don't know if it's a lesson or something Up. and this is from Teleflora so I might um, this was made in Brazil and it's just a little bunny hugging a, uh, a butt face so cute for Easter but I don't wait for Easter I'm, if I decide I don't want to keep it um, I just sell it sorry you guys for the rattling And I picked up this. It's just a cute little vase, green. I just love, love, love. Very cute. Guys, give me a second because I dropped something. I'm learning from you guys because sometimes I just don't even bring the receipt home. But I want to remember what I paid. Not that they give you a discount or anything, or not a discount, but a return. Um, and this is another um, hand done piece. It is signed on the bottom. I think it says Gail, no, Kyle, Kyle something. But it's just a cute little, it has the American flag colors. And then it's got the hearts right there. I just think it's adorable. It needs to be cleaned up. But little by little, guys, I'm going to incorporate this into my live sales. So make sure you meet, meet up with me on um, every Wednesday, 10 o'clock Eastern, 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern, and uh, Saturday, one o'clock Eastern. This is the other. Now this one has the name on it. It says Field Flowers Foaming Bath. And there's nothing on it. So this one, because it has a label on the bottom, I'll sell this one and keep the other one in my collection. They do need to be cleaned because they're very dirty. And um, I think that's it. Oh, and I also picked up this, this plastic clear food wrap 
I use these all the time like if I'm packing something that um, it's light. I don't want to do a bunch of bubble wrap and stuff like that. And maybe if it's something that's unbreakable, I'll just wrap it really good in the newspaper. And then I shrink wrap it with this. So with this, I'm going to keep. This is excellent. If you sell books, you, instead of using bubble wrap, if you just wrap them in this stuff, it works very good. I go once this way and then once the other way, and it works just fine. Okay, guys. Once again, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching. Leave me a comment below. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and uh, ring the bell so that um, you'll know when I have new stuff uh, for you guys to watch. Thank you. Have a great evening.